Today we're going to pair our embedded transmitters squid board and bogey board to our Elite 4 channel receiver. So, here we have our Elite main receiver, pre-wired to 230 volts, with relay 1 wired into this light here. Squid board is a simple piece of kit, with four pre-wired inputs, an onboard antenna and a battery connector. It's compact and the legs are flexible, meaning you can easily move out any unused inputs and also fit it behind a range of different enclosures. For this example, we're going to simply use a wall gain switch and pair it into our receiver. So simply strip back and wire in the inputs that you intend to use. Now, as it's only a single gang switch, three of the output pairs have just been left covered. Then, just apply power with your PP3 battery. Then fold the legs and the battery to keep that you aren't using to keep them out of the way when you're in the enclosure. Now bring back your elite receiver and also your wired and squid board. Momentarily hold down the sync button and you'll see that all of the LEDs flash. Again, momentarily press it and you'll see that relay one flashes. During this time, switch your wall gain switch and you'll see that that is now paired to the light. Once you are happy with your pairings, simply attach the fascias to the elite and also your wall gain switch and then you can fix it on the wall wherever you choose. The bogey board is a very similar product to squid board with four inputs, an onboard antenna and also the battery connector. The main difference is that there are screw terminals as opposed to it being pre-wired. For this example, we're going to wire the bogey board into this simple switch that has an on and off and we're going to pair that into our Elite receiver. So bringing back our remote, as you can see there's a simple on off two button setup and inside there's two different screw terminals. So what we need to do is wire in our bogey board. Now for this example we've already pre-wired the bogey board with two of the inputs ready to go for this remote. So all you do is secure each of the wires all safely wired in then you need to apply your power so connect your 9 volt battery so bringing back your elite receiver board again along with your wired in boogie board like we did on the squid board Momentarily press the sync button, all of the LEDs will flash. Momentarily press it again, and relay one will continue to flash. During this time, continually press the button of the transmitter you wish to pair, and you'll see that that pairs to the light. Again, to pair the second button, momentarily press the sync button, all of the LEDs will flash. Momentarily press it again, and pair in the second button of the transmitter. Once you are happy with your setup, simply take the faces receiver and your transmitter and screw them down then you can mount your elite to wherever you wish to position it.